good morning students how are you all doing we meet again today our topic is hydrogen and its compound hydrogen and its compound and we have objectives at the end of this class you should be able to de define or explain hydrogen identify laboratory preparation of hydrogen and explain how you can prepare hydrogen in the industry okay these are the three objectives we have in this at the end of this lesson so get your written materials ready you have to be jotting down something we are going to start as hydrogen as an element hydrogen as an ele element hydrogen as an element hydrogen is the last is the lightest of the elements do you know the lightest of the elements making up about one percent of the earth crust it is found uncombined only in very small amount in the atmosphere hydrogen is distributed in combination with other elements in form of water acids organic substances and petroleum products okay hydrogen is what atomic number one relative atomic number one as well that is hydrogen for you you sometimes behave like a meter sometimes a non-meter okay now how do we prepare acid in the lab the three methods that we use is action of dilute acid on zinc. If you pour acid on any zinc material, hydrogen will be given off. That is one method. Action of cold water on active metals. If you get metals, something like aluminum, calcium, potassium, sodium. And you pour water on it, hydrogen will also be given off. Action of steam on iron. If you pour your steam on iron, hydrogen will also be given off. These are the three methods you can prepare hydrogen in the lab. Okay? Are you with me? So if you ask the three methods you can prepare hydrogen in the lab, action of dilute acid on zinc, action of cold water on active metal, and action of steam on iron. These are the three methods. Okay? All right. How do we prepare hydrogen in the industry? We have three methods as well. One is from water gas which is what we call Bosch process Bosch process now how do we do this on a large scale hydrogen is prepared from water gas when steam is passed over red hot coke if you get coke you pass steam to it no steam is water that has boiled hmm? You pass steam to it at about 1,100 degrees Celsius. A mixture of carbon two oxide, which is what we call carbon monoxide, and hydrogen gas, known as water gas, is produced. You see, hydrogen gas is what we call water gas. The second way you can produce hydrogen carbon, hydrogen gas, is from hydrocarbon. The second way you can produce hydrogen is what from hydrocarbon. Now how? When methane is treated with steam in the presence of nickel, nickel is a catalyst. And what, what is the work of a catalyst? It alters the rate of a chemical reaction. It can speed up your reaction, it can slow it down. So when you get methane now, once you go to a park or anywhere, any scientific uh, line in a uh, park or wet, you, know, you can get methane there. You pass water, which is boiled water, on that methane. 
you can use nickel as your catalyst to speed up the process because it is a slow reaction at 800 degrees Celsius and 30 ATM. A mixture of same carbon two oxide and hydrogen gas is produced. This is what we call synthesis, synthesis gas. We have water gas, we also have synthesis gas. Then the last but not the least is by electrolytic method. This one has to do with electricity. How do you prepare hydrogen using electricity? Hydrogen is obtained as a byproduct in the electrolysis of brine. When a cheap source of electricity is available, hydrogen is also obtained by what? The electrolysis of acidified water. You see, once you pass electrolysis, electricity in uh, using brine, hydro, hydrogen gas will be produced. We call it electrolysis of brine. Electrolysis of what? Brine. So that is it. At this juncture, we shall call it a day. We didn't know what hydrogen is, how to prepare it in the lab, and how you can prepare it in industry. So, put this down. What is hydrogen? Explain it. Identify ways to prepare hydrogen in the lab and ways to prepare hydrogen in industry. And submit. Do have a great day.